Hi everyone, welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I've got my flexi hand and we're going to do a nice autumny set. I'm gonna be using some Nail Nails colors, acrylic colors. Um, I've got ruby red. Um, I don't know quite what the difference is between this one and pure red. Normally I have pure red. I think this one might be a little bit darker, but I'm not too sure. Um, I've got elegance, which you will have seen I've used before. It's quite a nice soft color. And I have got Aztec Copper. This one didn't have a sticker on the bottom because it's one of their um, discontinued pot sizes. But this is really, really pretty, this one. <laughs> and I'm going to be using Full Festival Glitter from Nail Sugar. Because, of course, we need a little bit of sparkle in our nails. I really like this one. It's got like a hint of cherry in it or raspberry. And I'm going to be using these Autumn Leaves vinyls from cat sass nail creations um i thought i thought it was sass nail creations but like obviously there's a cat in the sticker so i've said it wrong so it's cat sass nail creations i will get it right i'm sorry about that audrey oh sorry audrey um so to start with i am gonna be putting some of the i was gonna say pure red but it's not just ruby red at the cuticle area of our pinky and I'm just going to work it down and then at the free edge I'm going to place Aztec copper um, it's got like it's not even oh, it's not like glitter it's more like like flakes through it like gold flakes oh what was that that was my son's iPad um, and I'm going to do like um, an ombre I do go back later on and put some glitter on this nail I was going to leave it like that but I was like no it needs some glitter the ring finger i kind of at the moment like the ring finger is always a marble nail i don't know what it is it just is so i've put some of the aztec copper at the cuticle area and then i'm going to take some wet beads of each color and i'm going to work the tip of my brush through it um the majority of the time i'm going to be going from like bottom left no yeah bottom left up to to top right see what i mean like in a diagonal line and don't overwork it because you don't want it to end up like a mush a mush <laughs> a mushy mess but you obviously want it marbled enough oops i don't know what i've done there what happened there it is so there we go so just gently work them together i really like these colors i don't usually like red but autumn leaves a lot of autumn leaves go red don't they before they go brown um and some of them are the most amazing like almost like a purpley red i don't have a purpley red actually i've got a really nice color no i'm not going to say anything yet <laughs> um i might not even do anything actually with it but anyway just shush i'm going to put some of the fall festival glitter through the marble as well to add a little bit of twinkle Gonna leave it like that i like that i like it a lot and then the middle finger i am gonna do a full nail of elegance um and then i'm gonna add some other shiz to this nail so i don't know if i do it straight away or if i do it later sometimes when i'm doing a set of nails i'm not entirely sure what i want to do so i just kind of like for instance i go back to the pinky in a minute because i i don't do you know what i mean i just i've just i'll put the acrylic on and then just i'll just see how it goes we just go with the flow <laughs> and this was one of those sets i knew which colors i wanted to use but i didn't know exactly how or in you know what kind of design i wanted to use you know what i mean um this nail is gonna be a complete cover of a complete cover um the the base color of this nail is going to be aztec copper can you see what i mean by this acrylic I'm working quite wet as well because I want this nice and thin um, because I wasn't sure initially whether to do the index or the middle finger but one of these we're gonna cover with leaves and um, so obviously I'm covering the middle finger now with that full festival glitter so the leaves are gonna go on the index finger and I do pop a little leaf on this middle finger as well I'm just gonna do like a glitter fade so we're just gonna fade that down a little bit and we're going to leave the free edge free of glitter because that's where we're going to pop a leaf isn't that pretty though 
um the i can't remember what i do here oh i, I was going to initially cover the whole nail in ruby red and then i decided that i was going to do a a bit like what i done with a pinky but i put it up at an angle with the aztec copper this ruby red acrylic was really nice to work with it just kind of it just it just was nice so i'm going to put the aztec copper at the free edge and then i'm going to work it up i was like faffing like just faffing so badly with this um oh hang on i do in a minute right so you can't see what i'm doing here but i am doing a swoosh because we do like a glitter swoosh don't we and obviously it's the fall festival glitter and I cut some of it out because you couldn't see me doing it. So I'll just like. So I'm just using the Aztec copper to just sort of do like a bit of a. I don't know. I just wanted to add a little bit more. I just wanted to break that red up a little bit. And then I'm going to put some of the full festival glitter in kind of like a, a very faint swoosh. Just where the. Aztec copper meets the ruby red acrylic. I hope that makes sense. And now I'm going to take the vinyls because I love these. I absolutely love these shapes. I'm just going to take random. I'll try to pick different shapes because you get lots of different shapes. So um, the first one is going to be this longer leaf. And all I'm going to do is stick it to the nail. So you're going to need tweezers to get these off because it's just easier. And what I like to do is slightly bend the sheet of stickers. And then when a, when one of the edges of the sticker pops off or pops up, I will then use the tweezers to pull that off the sheet. So all I'm going to do is go down this nail, fill in the nail with all the different colours of um, the leaves that I've got. And there are four colours. There's metallic brown, metallic copper, metallic gold, or is it champagne? I can't remember. And metallic platinum, which is the silvery colour one. So I'm going to just, that's all I'm going to do on that one. It's like, you know when you walk on the ground and it's just covered in leaves? That's kind of what I was going for. And then the middle finger, I've took a brown leaf and put it at the free edge because I just thought it was nice against that lighter colour elegance. I'm going to take another gold leaf and I'm going to pop it on the thumb. Initially, I wasn't, I wasn't sure which way to put it. I was like, this way, this way, this way. And I kind of wish I'd put it the other way now. <laughs> But never mind, it's done. And then I decided to just add one more onto the pinky. Again, I was like, should I put it up there? Oh, should I put it down there? And I decided to put it sort of more to the bottom, more towards the free edge. Yeah, there, 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 there. No, there. Um, so that's that. So that is what we're looking like before we cap it. I am going to show you me capping the pinky because um, someone commented saying they liked watching... Um, I can't remember who it was, I'm sorry, I'm rubbish at remembering things. Um, they thought watching nails being capped was therapeutic. <laughs> I think that's what they said, I can't remember. So I thought, right, we'll just throw one in there, because I hate capping nails, and I, I always feel like I use 50 million beads. I did actually go ahead and pop a couple more beads on this one, um, but I think I did make it too thick. I kind of have a habit of making my nails too thick. See, that would have been perfect. I was just worried that when I fold it, I was going to go through it. I don't know. I'm such a I'm such a fruitcake. But anyway, that is... I'll just I'd leave it like that. So, I filed and capped. No, I haven't. I filed and buffed. <laughs> and it's top coating time. And the top coat I'm using today is the Temper and Top Coat from SPD London. Um, they have a Facebook page. And you can also find... The group is called Louise's Nail Products. You'll find lots of images using the SPD London Gel Polish. Um, I will also leave in the description box the link to Cat Sass Nail Creations website. And if you haven't seen me doing the unboxing, go and check that out too. I'll leave a card at the end of this video so you can go and find it. Um, what else? What else? Oh, nail sugar. Um, don't forget, we have a nail sugar group. And if you want to get 10% off anything from the nail sugar website, you can use code NATMUG10 to save yourself 10%. Aren't these lovely? I really, really love these. I would absolutely rock these nails in autumn. And then this is the, the fallen leaves on the floor nail. 
You know, when you walk through all those leaves and they're all crispy and crunchy. Oh my gosh, I love autumn so much. <laughs> and then the thumb. Let me know in the comments if you've got a favourite nail out of this set. I'm not sure which mine is because I kind of like them all quite similarly. Similarly. And um, there we go. I'm going to pop this in the lamp to cure for 60 seconds. I've got an LED lamp. So this is them done. I will give you a close up so we can take a nice close up. Here we go. Oh, I love them. Oh, I love the stickers. They're so cool. Cute. I was going to say cool and then cute at the same time and it came out as cute. <laughs> Anyway, don't forget to like this video if you did like it or just like it anyway, because why not? And um, don't forget to subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, you might end up getting a spot on your bottom. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.